Oh boy, is this different. So, welcome to my room and slash, I guess, studio, I guess, in a way. Huh. So yeah, welcome. So pretty much this is where, it's not exactly the biggest room, but this is where I pretty much, I, uh, I sleep, I create, and yeah, chill out all the one, so I can have to make it as homey as possible. A few things in the walls, of course, you've seen the Death Star, there it is. Oh, when it's glowy, and it turns on, of course. There's the timer, but I obviously need to turn it off now and again because obviously it's battery powered and we're draining the battery. But that's pretty cool. So pretty much before we get over to the desk and show the setup, of course, of all the other things, let's go over back to the door. Here's the door, right here. And there's a few things, got a few hats from different things. This I got in a, I think it was a loot crate, I think, one of the, no, actually, this one's a loot crate, this was a Mario crate, what one I got in convention. Uh, what are the green hats I like to, what I like to wear? We're not exactly going anywhere in this, this time. And uh, this is also a few, my coats, uh, some of the bags I've used for other things, and most of all, where all my lanyards go, so yeah. So pretty much, there's a Bruni Scott vendor one. Uh, this is my normal one that I wear, obviously green fly. There's foolish and there's me, obviously green. And uh, it's also got all my badges. If you guys have actually seen me in person, then pretty much this is where the lanyard that I wear. So most of these badges are from different vendors as well. I like to collect badges. So we've got Spyro, we have Yuki Ponycon 2018, because I was there, haha. <laughs> we have Batman, uh, we have another one in GameCube, that was pretty cool. Oh, we've changed like as well, that was pretty cool as well, Smolder. And look, Richard Time, yay! Uh, what else we're going to the side? We've got a few other badges as well. Let's see, we have Prince Weather, we have Vegeta going final, yay! Dark Magician Girl, of course. We have Brony Squad 2015, if you can't quite see it, there it is. And we have Mary Sue, the best badge ever, of course. And uh, yeah, there's a lanyard that I promise you normally wear. And there's a few other a few other badges as well from other various conventions, of course. I've been to it. And there's a few other gifts I've gotten from other people as well. So yeah, there's me. I've got Google's eyes, apparently. That was very surprising. I completely forgot about that when she gave it to me. Thank you, Thank you very much. Ah, fantastic. So, anyway, uh, let's go back to where I create uh, where the magic happens of creativity, I guess. <laughs> so before we go over here to show you what exactly I'm working with, well, one of the things you're going to see, obviously, is the light. Yes, this is the light. So before, without this light, my room is pitch black. Because here's one of the problems. Yes, I have a very big window, but the light is a bit weird because of the angle of where my room is, unfortunately. So, with this light, by turning it on, my room is lit up and you guys are able to see me, because otherwise without this, well, you're not going to be able to see me at all. So, let's move over to the corner. I think you guys will be interested. Time moving past my chair, of course. So yeah, this is a few of my games and pretty much DVDs, and yeah. So pretty much I did have, this, is, I, this has been here for since I first moved, so pretty much it's been here. And yeah, uh, so pretty much um, still have, I still have a PlayStation, just don't play it. And this has some of my favorite games that I've kept still. So obviously I've got still Yu-Gi-Oh and stuff and Godzilla and yeah. Um, a few 360 games uh, that I like. Uh, Xbox One, still have the Xbox One. I haven't bought the new console, really. I'm really bothered because I just, I don't know, I just haven't played it as much. Like I'll maybe play most of these games usually during Christmas, like I got recently was Doom. That has been absolutely fun. And we have the DVDs as well. People have gave me um, a few Pokemon movies, of course. Uh, Lilo and Stitch. I don't know. I just like Stitch. That's quite interesting. And various other things as well. And a few other DS and 3DS games. Actually, I've just recently got back into playing my 3DS after two years. Wow, I know. It's been that long. Actually, I think it's been a year and a half. But yeah, you know what I mean. You know, lockdown, all that kind of things. Uh, right here is my shelf of various figures. This is probably mostly the pony shelf, I guess you could technically say. Well, I mean, I, I, I ran out of room. I got War Graham on. This was a figure that I actually built. Uh, this was for my birthday last year, and my god, I had fun building them. He's just, oh my gosh, oh my god, so good. Look at that. The detail. I love it. Uh, moving on. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z, of course, with Zen. Zen run said, I, I'm, I'm terrible, I'm terrible. Random Cowboy, Captain America, Deadpool. Uh, 
Hello there, thank you to the characters as well, Rarity. I'm going to choose for the other characters as well. And yeah. Uh, I've also got a few other kind of art prints that I got a while back from other conventions as well. They were pretty cool. And yeah, there's the Bronny Scott poster. We'll never see you again. Farewell. Right, I think I've tested it long enough. Obviously, you guys see my bed. There's Snorlax. Snow Snorlax. And yeah, so pretty much my room's not big. So there's where I make my clothes, my wardrobe. And yeah, now it's not big. There are a few things on the ground, but uh, that's because I'm trying to move things around. It's quite difficult when you can't spoil. It's really difficult. Right, anyway, let us get to the point. We are now at my desk. We're sitting at my desk right now. So pretty much, got the keyboard right about here. I'm gonna take my stuff. We have a mouse, this is my newer mouse as well. I think this was the G. I forget what the mouse is called. I am so sorry, but it's a much better mouse. I think it says it's a Logitech. Yep, it's a Logitech mouse. It's the G G two three. Yep, two three. Two or three, two or three, my god. Uh, this is the Go XLR mixer. This is the mini version though. I didn't really need the bigger version, I just needed the smaller one just to run this mic. This is the rod, NT I believe. Uh, so pretty much it has been a very, very, very good mic. I've liked this as well. I had it for a while when I was with my friend at the time and he had a mixer for two slots so obviously. Uh, but obviously I had another mixer before this one but it literally lasted for like a couple months and broke so not great. Um, I might get the bigger one, but to be fair, I don't really need the sound effect. This does everything I need it to do. I mute the button, you guys don't hear me when I'm doing streaming and stuff. Speaking of which, I need to get back to doing streaming. Yeah. So, we have a few other things. Uh, this is a Doom art metal print that I got recently. Pinkie Pie's behind there. Uh, we have still my little random coins. Uh, 5Ps. Uh, this is pretty much where my Xbox controller is that I use the PC for the Xbox One, which is under there. There it is. Huzzah! Um, uh, that's a picture of me and my gran and her mum as well. Ah, good times. Uh, random Gengar, Pokeball and a glass. And let us move the mic out of the way. Oh, yep, this is my boom arm as well. I am so glad I finally got a better boom arm. My god, it's so much better because you can move this and haha, done so. Right, let us hurry up and move on. So, we've got a few other various stickers as well. I've played from various conventions. So, yeah. Bonus on us. <laughs> Believe it or not, most of these people I have actually met in person as well. So, absolutely fantastic. Uh, so, we've got the camera here. This is the camera that is the main camera. This is the A... I believe it is the A5100. Yeah, 5100, I believe. Uh, it's an older model, but it does the job. It absolutely does the job that I need to do. And further of all, this is my TV screen that I use. I had another screen at the time. Unfortunately, it started going fidgety, but this does the job that I need it. This is where I see things, obviously, if I maybe listen to music or podcasts or whatever. And of course, we are now at the drawing tablet. The Huon drawing tablet. I can't remember the exact model exactly, but I will put the model in the description. But yes, this was my tablet. This is my tablet now. Before this, I had a bamboo tablet. Actually, I could probably get it right about now. Oh yeah, there's a few other things as well. <laughs> so let's see, the tablet, let me get it. It is here somewhere. And ah, sorry for this, but yes, this was my tablet. This was the first tablet that I used. I had this for going around, it still works. However, I wanted to get a much more upgraded version because this one was a little bit too small. Unfortunately, the newer ones they had were either exp quite expensive now because at the time that I bought the bamboo tablets, they were not expensive at all. They were actually reasonable, reasonable price. So pretty much, um, as you guys can see, you've seen the ultimate house robot here. I love this art print, it looks fantastic. Uh, a few of my art prints, art stuff is here as well. We've got some sketchbooks here, some kind of things that keep some notes, controller for the TV that I turn on. Uh, a few other supplies here, random sword. I believe this is Aragon sword as well. It is a prop, it's not real. See, made of foam, a, so you guys don't have to worry. Will not cut myself. Um, I've got a few other things as well. I keep some of the envelopes as well to send you guys stuff. And in those two, it's got my art prints and that as well. And there, I've also got some art prints over there as well. 
at this bit here. So pretty much these folders, some bigger art prints are here and stuff. So do not worry, I have your stuff all sorted. And I think that is about it. That is pretty much everything in my setup. That's pretty much, I don't think I've missed anything, but yeah, this is, this is my room. This little room is mine, all mine. And we of course just find the various things like the Velocal Raptor thing as well and yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I mean, um, I can't really think of anything else to say. <laughs> but yeah, bye guys. I wanted to guys just kind of show you um, how I kind of work day to day. I sit in this chair, of course you can say the orange chair. I like this chair, much more comfy than my last one. By far, it's actually the support. Memory foam, lovely. But yeah, um, I try and keep the desk tidy as much as I possibly can. This is the tidiest that I've had it, <laughs> I will admit. But there's organised mess and there's mess there's too. Um, of course, I've got to mention as well, my PC. This is my custom built PC. It is mostly just built for pretty much editing and drawing. A little bit of gaming, but not the like, amazing fantasy games. If I want to play an actual thing, like game, like maybe Doom, it's like it's an Xbox game. So, yeah. But anyway, um, that's the thing that's pretty much it. That's it. That's pretty much all I've got to say. <laughs> uh, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the little bit of the tour. This is pretty much me and this is this is it. This is all. I can't think of anything else. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much. And I will see you next time. And I think we'll look at something. One last thing. And I think we'll just random a look at Wargrave Man because he looks badass. Hey, hey. So yeah, bye guys. See yous.